It must have been, I've said it before in the boardroom, Steve, it must have been the longest two weeks of your life, the last couple of weeks. Yeah, these two weeks especially, but the whole, ever since May, with everything up in the air and trying to find out what's going on and where I'm going to be then. It's been a bit strange and a bit stressful, but glad it's over. Waiting outside the manager's office, you know what the discussion is going to be. What was that like? Um, a bit nervy, but I, did, I thought I did all right in the trial game, I had a few chances and that, and that's what my game's about really, just getting in the box, so... I thought I'd done all right there. And what was that feeling like when he said you've, we're going to offer you a contract, you're now a pro footballer? Yeah, it was a bit, it was a bit strange really. He probably just switched off after that. And <laughs> couldn't really believe what was being said, but yeah, it's a great, good feeling. You mentioned it to John before, but it has to be a dream come true, particularly when you got to the age of 22, you'd probably parked it. Yeah, well, that's it. I mean, a bit later than everybody else, but, you know, well, I think I deserve to be here and I proved that I could score goals at other levels when I stepped up at other levels, so... Hopefully I can do it again. Last two seasons, 64 goals, absolutely amazing. You must have been riding on the cloud. Yeah, well, especially when I had to, in the in the last game for Penrith, where I had to score to, to break the record and end up getting four, but it was, it was quite good, yeah. What was that like the other night, going back to play on your own stomping ground? Yeah, it was, it was a bit different, really. I've never had to do it before. But um, at the same time, it's good to see everyone, and we all want to see us do well. What sort of things have they said that the Penrith players about what they want to see from you now? Just, just well, I'd say more goals. There's quite a lot of them from Carlisle and Carlisle fans and that, so I want us to do well and hopefully get get a few games and get a few goals. Big challenge, Steve, you've already said that, but it's one that you look like you're up for. Yeah, I can't, I can't wait to, uh, to start properly now. I've settled in and work hard and hopefully progress as a player. Are you going to set yourself any goal-scoring targets? 30? No, <laughs> not yet. <laughs> Getting the team first. <laughs> Brilliant. Thanks, Dave.